now, Hawaii's most accurate weather with Kamaka Peeling. Clouds continue to thin out, skies starting to show its blue and the sun popping through, and that's what we're going to see tomorrow with moderate threats for our oceans. And our jellyfish are here. Full moon was a little over a, a week ago, so they're going to be lingering around on the south facing shores for a little bit. For ocean conditions, due to the strong winds that we have coming through, the gusty winds, we do have a small craft advisory that's been extended until Monday morning, now until 6 o'clock Monday morning for all you boaters. Now, the just breezy conditions are coming from this high pressure. Pressure system that's more towards the northwest of the islands and will continue to build north. Now, as I mentioned, the cool, cold temperatures last night and that we can see tonight is because we have more of a northerly flow with our winds, so more of that Arctic chill coming through. But as we move through tomorrow, these winds will then be shifting more towards the east, bringing uh, more warmer conditions so we can expect the lows and our temperatures to be uh, increasing slowly. Now in terms of shower activity as you see a very dry and stable atmosphere what we've seen today was fairly little sprinkles that really ended in a, about six hours ago this afternoon but since that time till now and what we will be seeing through the evening is drier conditions. Most of the shower came down really on Wailuaiki and the leeward um, mountains of Maui with little over two inches of rain and the eastern portion of Hawaii Island. But as the day progressed, we've seen clearer skies for Hawaii Island, so we definitely see more dry conditions coming through. In our future radar, nothing really, just scattered showers that will continue to come in with the broken low-level clouds, mainly impacting the windward and uh, the Mauka sections. So what we're looking at tomorrow morning at around 7 o'clock, Hilo's looking at about a 20% chance of rain. Hana's coming in with the most at about 40%, but as we continue to make our way towards the west, 10% chance for Oahu and Kauai. Now, Kauai will continue to see some cloud coverage through tomorrow, but it's going to continue to thin out. Now 10 to 14 footers up north, 6 to 10 for the west, 4 to 6 on the east facing shores, 1 to 3 down south. Now we are going to be having some series of swells, advisory levels possibly for the north and west tomorrow. Later on in the week, warning levels are possible, so hopefully there's that chance of the eddy to go. Now in the extended forecast, a lot of blue skies, a disruption in our wind in the middle of the week, but that should be returning by next weekend. Sam, back to you.